Okay, so now uh, Kibana has been unzipped. So we go to Kibana, then Beam, and uh, we have to start command prompt and go there. CD. Bin. Okay, so once I am here to install uh, XPack, what I do is I just copy this part and uh, paste it here. So this will install XPack to Kibana. So XPack is being installed to both Elasticsearch and Kibana. And Elasticsearch, we have already installed XPack and uh, we have also started it. Elasticsearch is up and running. Now we will install XPack and start Kibana, then we'll start our work. Ingesting data to Elasticsearch. Okay. Uh, this may take some time until that let's see log stash so uh, as i said log stash is used to transfer data to elastic search and uh, this here and we need uh, in log stash we need uh, some code that tells log stash what uh, we are doing so i have a code here and it has three main parts uh, i will include uh, by the way this code uh, i have uploaded it to my uh, uh, github repository here visualize nyc 311 calls with kibana it is here i will uh, include a link to it in the description section if you are interested to have a look at it so in here what we do is as i said look, we use logstash to import data to elasticsearch so first we speci we tell it where our data is in this input section it is information about the data i'm giving here the full path to the data to the uh, nyc 311 service requests and this one it is saying uh, start importing starting from the beginning then the second part is filtering the data uh here in this part i'm specifying the because this is csv this is comma separated values so the separator is comma i have the columns here the different columns in the data we can see these columns from this website the different columns are shown somewhere here uh, they are here column names we can see all of them all 53 columns are here so in this part i'm specifying the column names uh, Logstash, when it imports data to Elasticsearch, it imports all of them as text, but we have uh, date and latitude longitude information here, so we will change them to their appropriate uh, data types. In here, we are changing the created date column to date, and it is in its format is uh, year year, two digit year, two digit day, and four digit. Uh, I mean two digit uh, months, two digit day, four digit year, and then hour, minute, second. It has also half a day called AM or PM. Uh, we can see it by the way. I can quickly show you. Uh, if I go here, I have. Okay. <sighs> my data is in in here so hit let's say minus two and i see so okay this is a created date so its format is uh months two digit months two digit day for digit year then we have our mini second also we have uh, pm and am we have also other columns which are dead columns but let's just change one of them and leave the others because we will not use them for our uh, kibana dashboard anyway so uh, that is what we are doing here 
we are specifying the date format and changing it from text to appropriate date and also the latitude and longitude we want to change them to to tell uh, elastic search that they are uh, location information geographic location information so first we change them from string to float after that we are changing them to location and this location this location we have to uh, later as I, I will show we have to to tell elastic search that this location is a geo point or it is a geographic information uh, column so this is a template this template it helps me to tell elastic search that uh, it should consider location as a geo point if we don't do this uh, elastic search doesn't understand uh, simply the columns latitude and longitude as geographic information geographic location information if we are if i import this data to tableau or other bi tools automatically tableau can understand that latitude and longitude are most probably geographic location information is but uh, uh, geographic uh, location is but kiva uh, elastic search doesn't work that way we have to map the the latitude and longitude we first create a hash here as uh, a hash called for example here we create a location then this location we map it to geo point data type in uh, in elastic search as i will show later okay so let's see if our installation is complete okay so xpack is now uh, installed to kiban also okay so what are the steps we need here once we install xpack we have to start kiban and uh, to start Kibana, we go to the Kibana folder, bin, and double click this one, kibana.pat. This will start Kibana. Okay. Until it starts, the next thing is we navigate to this one uh, localhost. The port is 5601. So let's copy this. And to log in, XPark, it needs login credentials and we have the username is elastic and the password is changing